Hello Libra, welcome to your October 2022 general reading with myself, Thomas Janak. You're watching Thomas's Tower Readings. Please like, subscribe and share. And if you like my work, you can now buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. Now Libras, what we do here, we will divide the reading into small sections so it is easier to understand. So we will look at the overall energy first before we then look into your emotional core, see if there's any healing that um, is happening, any love stuff happening, before we then lastly go into opportunities as they present themselves to you in the month of October. And with a little luck, there should also be a full moon video <coughs> on the channel. Um, if you subscribe, you uh, will not miss it. Really, really important. So let's have a look at your overall energy for the month of October. Now, the overall energy for the month of October for the sign of Libra is purity. I don't know if you can see this here. Okay, so in short, what that means is for you to understand that you know you, you can choose your battles. Uh, remain as pure as you are. You know, be be your true self, really, really important. But what I'm getting is, is that other people um, influence your behavior um, quite a bit. And so it is important not to get bogged down by other people's opinions. Or maybe you are a person that just gives too much. Uh, who knows? The point is, Libras, your imprint as a sign is a sign that looks for harmony. That's all you really want. And um, and purity means to be who you truly are. But because you are looking for that harmony, sometimes you're, you're, you're too understanding um, and you're too giving and it doesn't always serve you. So purity, therefore, for your sign in October really means to step back from everything, you know, and be who you are and maybe recharge a little that's really, really important so what i'm getting strongly is for libras um to watch your stress levels stress your stress levels in october because too much can knock you for a loop completely and it's just not worth it okay so that was the overall energy now let's have a look at the um your emotional core see what's happening so whether or not love is coming in, the guides don't show me. <clears throat> but what I'm seeing, uh, pun intended, because your, your topic is illumination. So what I'm, what I'm seeing for you is to understand that whatever needs to come out this month, whatever needs to happen, you will see it. That's quite important to realize and to recognize that because your intuition is always being on uh, and you know literally who's full of crap and you know what isn't for you and what is for you. October will illuminate everything and anything to do with your emotions. You will therefore be much more in tune with yourself, which goes hand in hand with the purity. What I'm also getting for you is um, detoxing. Um, so that's another really important thing. Um, remember everything you, 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 you take in, everything you eat becomes a part of you for some time. Um, I'm getting I'm getting the topic or the ter the, the term um, detoxing, and I'm getting it from both a spiritual and a physical level for you Libras. So maybe this is a good month to um, indulge less, which also goes hand in hand with the with the topic of uh, purity, which is your overall energy for the month of. October, but the illumination as a, as a, a topic or as a theme for your emotions um, is a positive thing because you know um, anything that is hidden will not be hidden for long, and you will see it. It'll come out, and when it comes out, it's usually ready to let go of it, which is really really powerful, right? And now we're looking at opportunities as to present themselves to you in the months of October, twenty twenty two. Here we go, and you have protection. So, in short, opportunities in October for Libras don't feel to be super abundant, if that makes sense. But what you are 
encouraged to do is rather than looking for the next thing um, that gives you more uh, financial abundance, um, make sure that whatever it is you do, let's just say for a living or whatever it is that sustains you financially, is really your thing. Because in order to feel protected, you only feel protected when you are in an environment that reflects your thoughts and your energy. So therefore, when it comes to opportunities, rather than chasing new beginnings, um, which is also a topic because October is the 10th month and we don't really count the zero, even though zero is important mathematically, um, just like January, October and January both have the energy of one, uh, which is new beginnings. Um, which means um, by default you can be a bit more pushy in October uh, and get more done. Um, but because you have protection as uh, with regards to opportunities, it is really important that you feel safe, that you feel you belong, if that makes sense. Because protection is a weird term. It's not that you need protection um, as such, but when you feel you're at home in what you're doing, you feel quite safe. And that's what this really refers to. Okie dokie, guys, that's all we have time for. Uh, thank you so much for, for watching. Please like, subscribe, and please, please, please share widely. It helps um, us to grow the channel. And again, if you like my work, you can buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. Thank you all for watching. See you next month.